What's going on YouTube? This your boy Tay. Welcome to the channel Tay Trending. Today we got a completely different type of video today. Um, we're actually going to be doing a day in the life with uh, my Tesla Model X um, 90D. Um, I just got this car maybe two three weeks ago man. Um, I traded in uh, my 2013 SS Camaro for this car. I was starting to have a lot of issues out of the car, man, and it was definitely just time for me to upgrade and do something a little different. So here I'm just kind of showing you the car a little bit, um, some of the things that I've already done to the car a little prematurely. Um, I was super excited as soon as I got it, man. So it was a million things running through my mind that I wanted to do to it. Um, so as you can see there from the beginning of the clip, um, I went ahead and got this carbon fiber kit. Um, which included like the door handles, um, the back panel piece for the back, um, the side mirrors, and the spoiler. And the spoiler, and I believe it was about four or five hundred bucks for the whole kit. Um, and uh, it's really dope. It turned out really nice. I think the carbon fiber blends very nice with this bluish gray that this car is. It's a very strange color, um, very hard to describe. It's like a grayish blue. In a way it's got some hints of blue in the gray but it's a really nice car man completely different than um i would say what i'm used to with the 2ss camaro obviously those cars are super loud um completely different a lot more components to the car you know with these teslas man it's very low maintenance the only thing that you're really having to worry about on a day-to-day -day basis is making sure that your tires are good and um Honestly, that's about it. Tires and brakes is really your main concern with driving a Tesla and just making sure that you keep it charged. Um, luckily for me, uh, I live in Raleigh, North Carolina. So I'm in an area where we have a multitude of charging stations for EV vehicles. Um, just around me, it's like three or four different superchargers in the Raleigh, Durham area. So never have a problem with charging. And I also get free charging from my job, which you'll see a little bit later on in this video. Um, I believe right now, um, this was my first time trying out uh, my POV equipment. Um, so really just kind of, you know, getting used to that trial and error. Um, this is something I definitely want to get into more of and just start doing more of these type of videos. But here I'm kind of just getting used to it being on my head. And um, it's really odd, it's awkward. I'm still kind of trying to get used to it especially in traffic and things. Um, one thing that I dislike about this car right now is this car has absolutely 0% tint on it. Actually, the tint's like 100%. There's no tint on the windows at all. Like people can see straight through. So with the head mount on, uh, you look a little funny, you know, driving around with the head mount on, but you know, it's all about the content. I'm doing it for the content for the YouTube. So I'm really not too worried about that. But um, one of the, modifications i'm looking to do the soonest is definitely going to be the tinted windows uh, i want to get my rims powder coated um and i got a amp and a subwoofer that i need to go get hooked up as well so about three things that's on my list to do within the next three months here so really before the before christmas i'm looking to have my wheels done the windows tinted um and then have my system hooked up for Christmas, that'd be kind of like my gift to myself, getting this car pretty much fully how I want it to be. And then from there, um, my content ideas right now, I'm thinking about taking some Tesla road trips, you know, maybe going from places like North Carolina to DC, to Maryland, to New York. We have a lot of EV Tesla charging stations here on the East Coast. Um, so I think some of those road trips would be hella dope, man. And as you can see here, this is our charging. Uh, station area at my job um, so we have about eight to ten uh, EV chargers so it's super convenient and um, a great perk through my job it allows me to actually charge for free while I'm at work so it's pretty hard to beat that so just imagine if you know your employer was paying you free gas to come to work you know that's kind of how I look at it it's pretty dope um, so it's kind of hard to go wrong with the car man so right here um, I was actually charged up and I was unplugging here to go on break and then you'll see me actually plugging back in because i was coming back in from break so that might have looked a little confusing um but that's basically all that was so this is me now like i just said coming back in from break and um these are actually called 
smart connect i believe so these are not tesla specific so every tesla is going to come with your adapter piece you just have to clip that on to the actual charger adapter and it fits seamlessly it goes right in and it starts charging almost instantly man and it's pretty much it man it's been pretty dope so far and as you can see here once i got to work i checked my tesla app and we are charging